What's up guys? So today I got the T-Rex 4 out finally as a request of a viewer and kind of sick of getting hung up on the bumper. So I did this. And you may be like, what the heck is that? I don't know what you're doing to your T-Rex 4, but whatever. Performance over style at this point in the body shell. Because look how destroyed it is. Like that body shell, it had cracks back here, really, because all the destruction. Uh, everything else is actually fine, though. So I just don't really care about the body shell that much anymore. That's why I totally destroyed it. But today I got a crawler course made up with all this wood, barely even used most of it. And there's still loads to go. So first of all, we got a little like up and down section here. Then we got a cross up and down. And then we got slanted up and down. You can see that I had very many ideas for this course. And then we got some kind of like wobbly section that I don't really know what I did there. And then we got, this was supposed to be a side hill. It works. It works going this way, but not going that way. So, eh. But then you come around here and up the logs of doom. It's pretty cool. And then try to turn around, make a straight descent down there. It's very hard actually. And today we're gonna do all that. So the bumper should help. So before we go, make sure you subscribe maybe if you're new and like this video. And thanks for watching guys. Alright, so kinda hard. Kinda hard and it's pretty hot out. Those portals definitely do help, but these logs are like so steep and crazy that it's just see we're dragging on the diffs and on the axis. Uh oh, off the course, that doesn't count. Alright, better better line. There we go. Alright, tires gotta grab here. And it did. So we're good. Going, going, going. Alright, then this is like cross axle stuff. This is nuts. So here these are pretty evenly spaced, so it just straddles it with both tires on those two logs over there. And then we got the wonky section. It's pretty hard. It's not too easy. But oh god, it's a wasp. I hate wasp. Wasp just just Okay. Oh, I'm doing better this time than I did all the other times. All right, and if you couldn't tell, I already tested this. I test all my courses before I go, just so I don't bore anyone. Oh, wow, okay. Guys, if if there's any crawler out there that you think I should get, I'm thinking about a T-Rex 6, but if there's any other ones you want me to get, maybe I'll look, a, look at those. But T-Rex 6 is probably gonna be my pick for now. Okay, we're coming around really good. Tiny bit of body rub. Not too bad though. All right, we got a very hard first obstacle. Back tires cannot, there we go. Need a little bit of speed. There we go, we're going up, up, up. Now this one's kind of hard because this log goes slanted a little bit. So I had to put a log underneath of it, but that has collapsed. Let me fix that. There we go. Now it will not collapse anymore. It's still extremely hard though. A little jump, I think. Gotta go down. All the way down. So maybe a little bit of speed. Nope, 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 nope. All right, come on. 200 times the charm, and there we go, it actually was. All right, next stuff is pretty simple, but it's still kind of hard. Going up. Now we got this little dip, and then straight to the up. All right, tires are getting stuck in there. Now you'll see where the bumper mods come in place. Uh oh, no you won't. Now we can go. It hits that belly a tiny bit, and that's what throws it off. So it's tiny bit hard, there we go. All right, let's get another view. All right, we're gonna come down really abruptly here. There we go. 
and straight to the up. I put it where it just has enough room to clear it. And now you're gonna see where the bumper comes into play. There we go, didn't even touch. Well, a little bit. But without that, it would have touched a lot more. So here I found unlock diffs to be really good. Like unlock diffs actually help so much. I just gotta line this up perfectly because if I don't, it will die. No. Okay. Lock diffs should be good to go straight down. It's very, very narrow. Okay, we're dragging on the pumpkins, which is kind of a good thing, kind of a bad thing. Oh, uh, if that little log on the side hadn't been there, would have made it. Not made it, I mean. All right, let's just try it backwards now. I've already determined that it cannot crawl up those logs. So, unlock diffs. Turn it sharp. It's really good turns with unlock diffs. This is hard. This is really hard. Oh, see, bumper's not touching. Didn't touch that entire time. There we go. Oh, it's really scary. Oh, no. And we're dead. And okay, now I've changed it up a little bit where that's more flat. That flat one is very flat and it squishes itself down. Uh oh, now it's going to lift itself back up. Now we're good. All right, now we still got belly drag a lot right here. So we're going to have to. We're going to have to die. That's what we're going to do. This is hard. There we go. This hobby wing axe is beautiful. Okay, I'm just going to hold the trigger very slow. See how it still goes the same speed the entire time? It's amazing, except when it goes downhill a little bit. And I don't think the bumper will touch. And it didn't. Nice. All right, so can't side hill it right here. And it does do this extremely easily with like no challenge at all. Too easy, too easy. All right, so a little bit oh wow that is weird come on I need to do the same to the front that I did to the back and but that's a lot more work than the back was because you literally got to dig out that grill all right we're somehow making it oh pumpkin touch can't get around there there we go all right, there we go. Pumpkin touch though. Oh, I'm almost tripping over more wood. There we go. Oh, that's a nice tire flex. This thing has really nice tire flex now. Because as these tires get older and you cut those little dimples off of the middle, they get a lot more squishy. So guys, thanks for watching this video. Hope you liked it. If you did, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. See you guys later. Bye.